All right, so we just made it to the train station. Which is the train station that will take you up to the Christ, the Redeemer. We took an Uber ride. Uber took about 20 minutes. We're about to find out pricing details. Alright, uh, Mix. Talk to us. How you feeling, man? Feeling good, man. It's gonna be fun. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm very excited for this. Very excited. Yeah, me too, man. First time, man. Yeah, I might be more excited for the train than Pastu himself. So we'll see. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so this is the first time. Probably, who knows? Maybe first and last time. So this is big right here. This is this this is a must do when you're out here in Rio. You know, your your trip is not complete to Rio without a visit to Christ the Redeemer. Got some drinks here, so you know, I'm gonna have a couple beers. I have that. So just finished the train ride. The train ride was about 30 minutes. I thought it was gonna be an hour, but it was about 30 minutes. And uh, we're heading over to the statue now. It's cold up here. It's down when you're back down in, in the city. It, it, was, it was warm, you know, it was mild. Stop. Brought a sweater. Oh, now John the Taurus, Taurus. Who's not from here? I play this cold weather. <laughs> You've been away from Baltimore for a long time, so 
<laughs> That's why you're cold. Coming up on a on a lookout before we get to the actual statue. What's going on, everybody? John the Taurus Taurus here, and I hope you've been enjoying this video thus far. So, on my way up to Christ the Redeemer, the wind got so intense that you could barely hear what I was talking about. So, at this point, I was basically talking about the fact that we have escalators, as you see a couple people going down them right now, as well as this building with the green wall off to the right. Those are elevators. Those elevators will bring you down to the train station, or if you are arriving, they will bring you up to Christ the Redeemer. I'll tell you what, there's a lot of stairs. So if you're not looking forward to walking up a whole bunch of stairs, I would say take the elevator. So this is something that surprised me. And it surprised me immensely. The amount of people that were at Christ Redeemer that day. I tell you what, there were people from all over the world. From the United States, Canada, Mexico, Europe. Other countries throughout South America, such as Argentina and Peru and Ecuador. Wild, wild to see the amount of people that were, again, not just there that day, but how far they traveled to be there. And look at this. And there it is. Christ, the Redeemer himself. You know, to see the statue on movies or TV shows, YouTube videos. It's, it's cool, right? You can try to picture yourself there. But once you are there and once you see it for yourself and, and you see those 360 views of Rio de Janeiro, Brazil, it's amazing. It really is. So I'm going to stop yapping and go back to the sights and the sounds. Christ, the Redeemer.
He's like, yo, come on, man, yo, help me out, man. Look at him, look at him, yo. Yo, help me out, man. I'm hungry, man.